about 1.7 billion threats have been uh, have been identified. That means now uh, those threats are bound to increase in uh, in numbers because the more you digitize, the more you bring your services on board or on digital platforms, the more the threats increase and the more the threats continue changing. So I think with that uh, increasing threats, we need to have in place proper systems, mechanisms, and tools that protect our data, or government data for that matter, so that the government information as well as the citizens of this country are both protected from uh, cyber crimes and cyber attacks and cyber threats. Uh, the government is uh, in the process of uh, laying uh, 100,000 kilometers of, uh, of fiber optic within the government of Kenya, within the boundaries of the Republic of Kenya. Out of that, so far, I think 18,000 kilometers of fiber optic has already been laid. And as, as far as the onboarding of the government uh, services is concerned, about 17,000 17, government services have already been uh, onboarded and they can be accessed online. And quite a number of digital hubs have been, uh, have been put up across the country, as well as the digital hotspots and Wi-Fi. So the government is in the process of achieving, I think by 2027, we'll have achieved the targets within the PETA uh, manifesto. The war in Palestine and the war in, uh, with the Palestine-Israel war affects us as, as a country in Kenya and also affects organizations. You'll find there are some companies that probably have support from companies, say, based in Israel or based in Palestine, that are now being affected in terms of their operational uh, resilience. But over and above that, um, in terms of the economy, we, we also suffer in, in, in some sense. And um, that now um, helps us to fortify ourselves and try and see how can we mitigate those threats, how can we mitigate uh, those risks that are arising due to such um, neopolitical or geopolitical uh, tensions uh, within. We increase the number of certifications on security, on risk, on governance, uh, recently on data privacy, um, and also now on emerging technology. So we have currently nine certifications which are there. One of them, the ninth one, uh, is, uh, is on the beta stage on, 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 on cyber security an analyst.